What's going on, everybody? Welcome back to Mike and Moochel's Happy Birthday Happy Hour. Do we take Mana Mock Sapphire or Mana Drain? Are you joking? Did you ever get a deck? Chad, I think I did a while ago, yeah. Am I joking? It's Mock Sapphire, right? Yeah. Okay. Just making sure. Of the time. Just making sure. 99% of the time. Chad, let's see if I can find time. it on YouTube and I'll send it to you. What was the sword step? Was there a sword step? Travis? Oh, well, I like a volcanic island. Yeah, me likey. <laughs> me likey. Also keeps us open. I like a Demir signet, too. I'm going to go get another coffee. Okay, goodbye. Michael just left and now I don't know what to pick. I think it's this one. Could be this one too. This one's very good. Take all the swords, battle skulls, and jet are both swords. Uh, no, let's see. There's only seven swords in the cube. Okay. All right, we can do it. Crutch Junior, we are still waiting for a good upheaval, wildfire thing. Okay, so take all swords. All right, we're going to take this batter skull. All right, we gotta, we gotta, we're doing this, we're doing this step now. What is it? Uh, all swords. <clears throat> so we just take every sword and equipment we see. Uh, take all the swords, batter skull and jetir both swords. No vetoes because there are only seven swords in the cube. Yeah, sometimes pretty good with the equipment. We could be, uh, we could be Jess guy. Yeah, it's pretty right. What were you going to say? I just say that was a pretty late Rafellos. Don't give a shit about Rafellos. We've got Mock Sapphire and Volcanic Island. Dang, we can't take through the breach. Whatever, I'll take Sword of Fire and Ice. It's fine. We're gonna, read my if back. we can get Stoneforge, I'm okay with it. Moochel, did you get my coffee? Sorry, Danny B. I didn't get you a coffee. He, does, he doesn't care about anybody but himself. You want a sip? Give him a little Put sip. Put your lips up to the camera. Put him, put him up. You can smell it, too. Can you guys smell it? I got the new smell -O camera. Can you guys let me know if you guys can smell that? Yes, it is coffee from a can. It is pre made coffee. Can we heat it up a little bit? Yeah, man. Oh, nice. Thanks. <laughs> I'm, I'm heating it up a little bit for him. See, that's hot. Nope. Not at all. I could take this Soulfire Grandmaster. That guy goes well if we get uh, any of these sweet. Wasn't there a time warp for one of the packs? Yeah. Maybe they'll come back. It's like nine mana, but yeah, it's still pretty good. Yeah, but it's nine mana for every turn for the rest of the game. Mitch. Frost Titan. We could just be double Titans here. Dubs Titans. Smuggler's Copter also pretty decent with swords. Yeah, it's true. Oh, two. Oh, there it is. There's That's the card we want up. for the sword stip. That's the one we want. Oh, baby. yeah. That's what father likes. That is what father likes. Oh, wandering fumarole. All right. Oh, okay. You know we're technically only white. Well, so far we are, but like I feel like this is a good this is a good base to. Oh, geez, Aleshnorn. <laughs> yeah, I'm just taking the Aleshnorn here. Or just mono white <laughs> with like three three blue white fixing things. Blue red, you mean? I don't like Recruiter. I don't think Recruiter is very good. I just don't want to, like, unless you're comboing, even then I'm still a little off it, but, like, I just don't want to spend three mana to play 
um to play a one one and then like pass the turn in vintage Q, I just feel like that's gonna be really hard to do. Uh Siege Gang Commander makes lots of lots of creatures to wear swords. Also, if we get like a Restoration Angel, it's pretty good here because we got Stone Forge, Sun Titan, and Siege Gang Commander. I, I love Spellseeker only if I can get Anse oh Dig Through Time and two Wrath Effects. I'm going to take the Dig Through Time. Yeah, it's I take her. That guy wears a sword too. Uh, I only like Spellseeker when I can get... That's so weird that it does that because I don't even get a chance to put it on my sideboard. Um, I only like... What was I going to say? I only like Spellseeker when I can get... Ancestral Recall? Or Time Walk, yes. Oh, Big Bribs. Big Bribs is pretty good. Big Bribs is very, very good, yes. Misty is also good, but... I don't care about no Misty Rain for you, little bit. <laughs> take, take Big Bribs. Michael, are you looking at my Big Bribs? I would never. You better not. I'll call the police. <laughs> Treasure Cruise? We already have Dig Through Time. How many cards are going to our graveyard, man? Good. I really have Lightning Helix. Over Silver Blade Paladin? Do you care about Silver Blade Paladin? He, he attacked very good with This sword. guy's coming back. Let's be real. No one's going to take Silver Blade Paladin. Okay. That's fair. Okay. Deal. Yeah, I'll take a fourth pick Mox or whatever. Third Deal. Pick. It's not color, but I don't care. Totally fine. Legionnaire, I bet Legionnaire and Silverblade Paladin are both still in this pack, guys. How you feeling? All right. Man, he's like he's like a healed man. Upheaval. I don't think that's gonna. Oh, Plateau is nice. Yeah, that's a good one. And then we have Volcanic Wandering and Plateau so far. That's pretty good. Yeah, I like that. What about here? What do we got here? Oh, well, there's the Resto we wanted. That's pretty good. Seems all right. Yeah, I'll definitely Resto. End of turn Resto equip. Yeah, let's do that. Time Twister. More like Shit Twister, am I right? <laughs> Gideon Blackblade and Lutero Core are both very, very good. I'm going to take the Gideon because, well, A, he's got a sword, so it's a very sword theme. Mike, if you were offered cybernetic upgrades, would you take them and would you still play magic? <laughs> yes and yes. I don't know why the I don't know why those two are I don't know why that would, yeah, why not? Hundred percent. Not even close. Because this guy gets gets equipped with a sword pretty well. Yeah, so does the unblockable guy. Oh now you care about sword themed. <laughs> yeah, but we already have Smuggler's Copter, which is kind of similar. Ooh, Elspeth gives you Yeah, let's take that. Gives you jumpy boys. We only have two swords so far, but they're both pretty good, though. You know what else is pretty good? Amoebas. <laughs> yes, amoebas. That's exactly what I was amoeba, thinking. Amoeba. Amoeba. I don't know what that is. It's a song. It was on Tony Hawk Pro Skater 2. Was it? Yeah. I feel like I'd remember that. Yeah, if you heard it, I think you'd probably remember it. I'm not doing a great impression for it. Well, just Google Amoeba. I know you get you'll get demonetized probably. Don't you, do it. Why don't you Google Amoeba? <laughs> <laughs> it's I, by uh, should not have been that funny, but it was Sonic Youth. No, oh, I Wait, like Weird Tear, but I also like Brimaz. I think it's Big Brims, right? Oh, it's the Adolescence. That's right. Yeah, yeah. Not not the Sonic Youth. We can rebuild him. We have the technology. Man in lab coat standing over Mike. Uh, I don't know if you know this, but Mike is like 6'10", so no one actually stands over Mike. <laughs> I'm only like 6'6 six, six and a half, okay? Hey, look, guys. Silverblade Paladin and Porcelain Legionnaire came back. I wonder which is better. <laughs> Probably Avacyn. Probably, yeah. I didn't even see that. I think Avacyn's better than both of these guys, I'm going to be honest with you. Yeah, I agree with that. Is Mir Mirren Crusader in the cube? I think Mirren Crusader is better than Silverblade Paladin. I think they're both in here. Both of them. Flicker Wisp, sure. It's playable. It is playable, especially because it's basically just like Resto version volume two. Version volume two. I hate you so much. 
I try not to. Give your show and tell. Probably just take Kithian. Over Daredevil? Yeah, Daredevil's pretty I mean, big. if they go Ancestral and you go Daredevil, like... They just both of Ancestral. You just get them in the butt. And the game is even. Oh, God, I really hate that. I don't like that feature. It's real jarring. Yeah, I hate to say it, but I don't think we're blue. Oh, Sword of War and Peace. I hate this. This is the worst sword. It's a sword that shouldn't exist. I mean, it should exist. It shouldn't exist. It's not good. Do we at least have Tundra? No, not yet. We got Mock Sapphire, Plateau, Volcanic Island. Oh, well. Gotta take that sword. Oh, Mom? Mom seems good against the sword, with the sword deck. Pretty good in combat, I hear. Alright, so... Enlightened Tutor is an option. Our mana's pretty good. Enlightened Tutor can get a sword. Enlightened Tutor can get a sword. That's true. Your mother can get a sword, too. Well, I don't know for I don't know for a Lesh Norn deck. Why not? We got two Moxes. It only costs five mana. <laughs> uh, well, if we play Moxes over lands, you see, is this a birthday stream? All birthday, all streams are birthday streams. Yeah, Mike's real tall. He's like, yeah, I'm pushing like six seven. I want to take this Hollow Fountain because it fixes our mana so well. And now, if we get any of the Scalding Tarn, uh, Flooded Strand. Aired Mesa combinations, we can get all our colors, which is nice. So I have my own coffee now, Mucho. You're so selfish on your birthday. In other news, what would you like the rest of the sword cycle? What do you? What would you like the rest of the sword cycle will do? I think you mean to do. Is there more left? I thought we we're all colored up. Wait, you, did you not see the new ones? I saw the black, red one, and the blue, white one. Yeah. So aren't there three more? Oh, they they haven't done allied, right? Right. Oh, okay. Well, dang it, Sword of Light and Shadow, you're always getting in my business. <laughs> Is part of the set that we have to play all the swords too? I don't know, probably. Inspiring Vantage, Banishing Light, Lingering Souls. Lingering Souls could be good. We don't have any black mana to actually flash it back. Chromox would be good if we didn't have so many swords that we have to. Dang, these are the two worst ones. Why couldn't they be Body and Mind and Feast and Famine? <sighs> I think it's just Vantage here. We're a pretty low, low to the ground deck here. Oh, well, I guess we're just going to hit literally all the swords this draft. <laughs> Nothing else in this pack I'm really concerned with. Oh my god, literally every sword. Man, we have to pass Hero of Blade Hold. That sucks. <laughs> oh my Christ, this is ridiculous. Well, at least we'll have our pick of the litter. Oh, Jesus. This is so many swords, dude. Adanto Vanguard with a sword is pretty good. What if we just get moat and then we just play it and then we can't attack with our sword guys? It seems terrible. Why would we do that? Oh, it's actually not that bad because we have a lot of flyers. We have smuggler's copter. We have... Okay, well, it's probably not that great. No. No. No, I don't like it. <laughs> All right, we need three cuts here. We only have 13 creatures, but Elspeth makes dudes... Bribery makes dudes. YouTube comments. He didn't take enough swords. Pretty much stole the money. Oh, God. We have all five of the swords in our deck. That's uh, unbelievable. The only thing we're missing is Jit. Yeah, that's literally the only thing we're missing. How do you like Kitchen Finks? Sure. Although this is a situation where <laughs> if, we, if we blink Stoneforge Mystic <coughs> with Flicker Wisp or Restoration Angel, we're probably always going to have something to get. So that's nice. I like... Ooh, Selfless Spirit seems good here. It floats. It protects. Oh, the want. Glory Ringer came back. I like that better than Siege Gang almost. Yeah, sure. We could, we could cast this off of our Mox Sapphire. Or Mox right. Emerald, rather. How exciting. 
You want to ring their bell? Oh, we got that back. That's oh, the that's last gash. pick hero of Blade Hold? Sure. All right, I want to be real. I don't think we're digging through time in this deck. Are we really bribering then? Why wouldn't we bribery? This is double blue. Are we just mono white? This is our mono white deck. So many swords, though. So what? What does that have to do with anything? There's too many swords. I don't know what that means. We can't take them out, so why like, not? Because is it's that part, part of the tip. Yeah, he set it up here. Let's read it. Yes, Mike, play all. Oh my god! <laughs> oh, that's so bad. <laughs> that's just that's life, man. Soulfire does seem bad, but I mean it's also a two drop. Just play sixteen lands. I'm mono white. We got two moxes. <laughs> is that a thing we can do? Okay, if we're going to play all five swords, I feel like we should play Enlightened Tutor. Really? Yeah. Why, though? He gets us any sword we want. But I don't think we care about getting the swords. I think we're going to draw enough swords on our own is really what I'm thinking. Okay, Dad. <laughs> okay, Dad. I'm okay, Dad. I really want to play that Elspeth. I mean, that Elshnorn. You do? Yeah. I don't know where we cut, though. I don't either, man. Sometimes it's three, not two. What does that mean? Yes, three. So you can get swords back with Sun Titan. We can also discard excess swords to Smuggler's Copter, which also is Also, Skull is a creature. Yeah, so it's 15. Plus, Elspeth makes creatures at just 16. 16. So that's, that's a good one. Gideon's creature. a creature at 17. Yeah, we got plenty of creatures. I mean, like, I'm not too concerned. Smuggler's yeah. Copter is 18. Like, there's plenty of creatures in the deck. Yeah, I can see cutting Soulfire Grandmaster. It, sure. It doesn't have yeah. any targets, actually. That makes sense. It's just a 2-2 lifelinker. All right, Mox, Mox... 15. Yep. Mono white. The mono white sword deck. Just feel like we could get away with 16 lands in this deck. I just don't like it because we have multiple 4, 5, and 6 drops. And like, two of our lands are moxes that are off color. Plus we can just loot away extra lands if we draw this. We also have Sword of Fire and Ice and Sword of... I guess that's the only one that loots. Anyway, we'll see. It's weird going from Mox Sapphire into Volcanic Island and then drafting the sword deck. Oh, keep. Snap keep. Oh, they went to six? They're dead. They can't win now. Really? You think yeah. so? It's, 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 it's over. Okay. Don't kill our mom. That's why I, I say that all the time. I'm like, hey, buddy. Don't kill my mom. Land. Cool. It's not worth attacking. Really? No. All right, I'll pass. Why well, open up your mom? You know. Okay, that's not a thing. <laughs> that's not a thing people say. Woo! We hit a land. All right. Now we can play our swordy. Uh oh. Three mana. Here comes Shardless Agent. Oh, here comes Master of the Wild Hunt. Oracle? Alright, that's better than. Oh, good. You get a little freebie. Fall into a guy's cradle? Oh, yeah, this is going well. They're doing more broken shit than we are, that's for sure. Okay. Alright, so you got Forest on top. Yep, seems good. You played all these things. Rex Age. Lovely. Awesome. Can't believe you'll target our mocks. Yeah, I kind of want them to because. Yep. That's good. 
Target creature, excel non-angel creature, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I think we're just dead here. It does look that way. That's not what father likes. Yeah, we're nope. dead. Cool. Must be nice. Main deck Rex Sage. We're playing against the uh, we're playing the five the six sword deck. Seems good. <sighs> See, I mean, I play a Leshnorm, but like we have no ramp whatsoever. Like I don't consider this ramp because it's taking mana slots. It's taking land slots. So. That's why I did like bribery. I'm not saying you wouldn't main deck Rex Sage. I'm not saying you wouldn't do that at all. That's we're just saying it's unfortunate for us. So this is what I mean. Like it's great to have mono white, but it's also like you kind of don't lose anything by adding all these fixing lands. All right, this hand seems better actually. Yeah, with five swords in the deck, the last thing I want to do is search for a specific one. I don't think that's I don't think wasting a slot and a draw step and a card in your hand on just searching for a sword is that great. I mean, if I have sort of war and peace, the last thing I'm gonna do is want to search for like body and mind because it takes so much mana and effort to do. Oh, uh, no attacks. If we can draw land here, I'd be very thrilled about it because it puts a lot of pressure on the board and we get to multiple white swords when they're playing blue-green. Out of all the swords in all the world. Nailed it. You okay? I'm just exploding. Well, that's unfortunate. All right. Well, we have a we have a floaty boy for sort of fire and ice at least. Three drop, three drop, three drop, three. We have seventeen mana sources in the deck, so it's not like we're playing fewer than we should have. Here comes Oracle. They're in Dynamo. Sure. Where's the black red sword, sword of light and shadow? Fantastic. Where's the black red sword when you need it? Fucking, are you serious right now? Thank you. This is unbelievable. BJC, thank you so much for the sub. Really appreciate it. Welcome, welcome. Exodia, please. <laughs> oh, crying out loud, man. Not real. We have drawn more swords than lands this game. <laughs> yeah, you better equip that guy. Well, you know what they say. I bless the rains down in Africa. Do you? You really do just have abysmal luck with lands. You've been watching other streamers, and it's not reasonable how often you get flooded or screwed, honestly. I feel like that's true, but again, like we've talked about this before, I always worry that it's just me being like, well, it's happening to me, so that's why it's so bad. But then again, like, it's... I, people say that, and then I'm like, oh, well, maybe it's more than that. I mean, in before they have Rex Sage in hand, I guess. We should have played a different sword to bait it out. No, I just want to get this online as fast as I can. I have a sign Flynn of War back from when you used to go pig, 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 pig. I'm surprised at how many people love that. That's hilarious to me. That has become such a meme that it's like, I, it's like such a, such a thing that I didn't even like consciously do. It wasn't like. It's old school. It's real old school. That was like TCG player days. Flynn of War, that was like, what, 10 years ago? Have you checked the difficulty settings on MTGO? Um, no, but I also could just turn it off and turn it back on again and see if that helps. Yep, of course you have it every game. Why wouldn't you? 
I was I was really hoping you would. I was like, yes, please have the exact card you need to deal with this, the exact turn you'll need it. And then they did, so cool. Also, um, Travis, don't even worry about it. Don't apologize. Like, it's not your fault we drew four of the swords. It's not your fault we drew more more lands than swords. Or sort of <laughs> the other way around. I still don't think the deck is terrible. Alright, that's yeah, that's pretty bad. We had a good time, everyone played fair and just a gorgeous set of games. Gorgeous set of games. <laughs> Gorgeous. Gorgeous. Opposition is not a real card. Oh, it's something all right. Oh, you're just going to play something, huh? Hmm. That's fascinating. Not like this. Good night, Cyborg Mike. Good night, Frank. Good night, Chat Mike. And happy sorting all. Danny, have a good night, buddy. See you later. Bye. Oh, man. That signed championship Matt, sounds legit. I guess we could actually give him pro green here and then swung for five, which is good. If they have two cards. Maybe they just have nothing, right? You can tap our lands, but you can never tap our spirit. Here comes, you guys ready for a uh, deranged tournament? Okay, well, no deranged tournament, I guess. Unless the last two cards are literally like forest deranged tournament. Might be. Man, they just keep getting in there with this guy. It's unbelievable. So what do they do? They tap two of our creatures. We can protect one. We can protect... Sort of blue is good because it can protect from opposition every turn. You got it. I don't think they have anything. I don't think we're... Too bad mom is a creature... Too bad Rob's mom is a creature you control. Alright, they didn't do anything. They can tap two things. We need to land here. You got that. Can't do anything about it. You're going to tap this guy too. You put the sword on him and then you're just going to tap him. Yep. I guess they're just hoping that we don't have a land here and we, of course, don't. Yep. It's only turn seven. Only turn seven. Oh. <sighs> It'd be so punished too if we actually had a land. Yeah, that'd be sick. <clears throat> Equip to a vanguard. Attack for five. It's okay, they had something else. Beast within their own land. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Sure. Yeah, I'm pretty sure we're dead here. I had some hope, but now it's gone. Yeah, now they just tapped on all the lands. I guess. Oh, we did not see John Wick 3 the second time.
we couldn't really coordinate a time to go so okay you're just gonna unload your hand well look you got four guys you can go tap 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 so many taps and then yeah i'm just not even gonna play this game it's not even fun i mean one player has resources the other player doesn't so magic is a good time for everyone involved dear diary today was a great day i got to see michael live for the first time and interacted with him and the other guy <laughs> no beats then gave me a sub and it was amazing is that hajigulashi gave you a sub not no beats unbelievable uh and it was amazing dear diary now i'm off to dream about the first visit to the channel it was exactly what i hoped it would be wow such a day me say day yo it's good Daylight come. Go on. Me want to go home. We'll go home then. See you later. Goodbye. I'm going to have some of these raisins. There's actually one raisin stuck to the side and it looks really gross. It looks like a little booger on the side. Let me see. Especially because there's like a streak. Ew. It looks yeah. pretty bad. But the rest of the raisins look delicious, so... All right, guys, we're doing it. Give me that turn one mox. That wasn't it. Okay, two lands again. Thankfully, this smuggler's copter will take care of it. Yeah, maybe this deck does need more lands. Uh oh. Oh boy. Yikes. That is what's known as one yikes for me, dog. One born power stone? Or a signet. <sighs> this has been a fun day. Land? Cool. Wow, two lands again, guys. Two lands. Two lands. Two lands. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Two lands. I am really bad at lands, yeah. Sometimes it feels weird to love a game this much that treats you so Doesn't poorly. Want to be back. Yeah, that that abuses you so much. Just figure out how to tap your mana, you idiot! Come on. <laughs> Michael's getting more angry than I am. So you get like seven hundred mana, and you're like, "Oh, what? That's what you played? Pathetic." <laughs> Pathetic. All right, we ain't out of it yet. My man. Baby. Yeah, I'll draw a card. Ooh wee. Uh, what are we? What are we dropping here? Sword, because we can get it back with Sidon. Yeah, I like that. Uh, we also need both. We'll keep the body in mind. I have 19 mana. Let me show you the awesome power of my porcelain legionnaire. <laughs> yeah, something like that. It did seem like that, yeah. It was very triple mox into mana tithe. Toilet warrior. Shut up and take my money. <laughs> that is Joker. Land step. This is where we draft more lands than swords, I think. I think that one's for the more lands than sword step. Oh, good. They kill our smuggler copter. Oh, God. They always have this. What are you splashing this off a of signet here? You got Island Island Misha's Workshop into, into Rex Sage? Come on, man. Come on. 
God, do we even cast this? I don't think it's worth. I don't think it is either. Like, I'd rather just keep my two mana up. Behold the awesome power of my porcelain legionnaire. <laughs> oh, no? You don't want that? You want me to you want to trade with our token? Deal. Okay, well. Eat your, eat your, take your medicine. Crutch Jr., I hear you. H, buddy. H is right. H in the chat. Type, can you guys pay your respects and press H in the chat? <laughs> oh, you guys are untap one land? Oh, they didn't do anything, huh? All right, well. Okay, so we're going to play this. Probably just play Stoneforge, right? What is it? What do you mean? Joe, what's the ATL mean, Travis? Uh, long time no see. I've been watching on YouTube since I started a new job. I'll re once I figure out what's going on with my Prime account. Miss watching. Miss Vixen, no worries whatsoever. Really appreciate it. Thank you so much for coming back. What did you say? Should we just Elspeth here? Uh, oh, that's actually pretty good. We can give this dude floaty. I mean, it taps us out, and it, if they have Counterspell, I guess they're going to have to tap a bunch of lands, maybe. Oh, yeah, of course they... A2 Mystic Snake. <laughs> nice. <laughs> oh, that's not very good. <laughs> Goblin. So Goblin Nick just sent me a message. And it's <laughs> <laughs> pretty accurate. <laughs> Legit dead right now. <laughs> Holy smokes, that's the <laughs> thing I've ever seen. Ooh, Goblin Nick, everybody. <sighs> Holy smokes, yeah, I'll be definitely be posting that in the Discord. All right, so they didn't do anything again. Land? All right, so now we can still play things if we'd like. We'll play Stoneforge here. What does that do? I'd rather just play Sword next turn. Well, because it makes our Swords only two mana. I'm going to do it because I like you, but... Dear God. Guys. Shut up and take my money. <laughs> Give them the A charter. <laughs> I, I think we're giving them the H pretty hard right now. Do you want batter skull? I like batter skull. Yeah, definitely batter skull. Yeah, definitely batter skull. God, this fucking winter orb, man. I can't even handle it. It's so annoying. How many times have we played against winter orb? This is twice, right? Yeah, at least twice. Man, Mike has been Mike has been bad luck today. We went three zero, and then Mike comes over, and we're like one two oh one. God, Mike, why'd you gotta why you gotta yeah, mess up? I just did. Blame me for all your problems. Well, they're your problems too. I guess so. Where are the moxes? Where is anything? Oh God, here we go. Yep, that's all I need to see. And that'll do, pig. Oh boy. Why don't we have any artifact destruction? Because we're white. White has tons of artifact destruction. I'm not in the cube though. And they got disenchant. They got uh huh. Oblivion ring. Banishing Light? Anguished Unmaking? Is Anguished Unmaking in here? My dad? Is your dad in here? My dad's in here! I'm just gonna submit like this. I, You know, I don't think we're... None of these sideboard cards are any good. I think we fell for the trap, man. The trap of Mono White. Well, it wasn't really a trap. It was a trap. We had to draft all the swords, Mutual. It doesn't mean we had to draft Mono White. Add land. Yeah, add land. I mean, to be fair, we do have 15 lands and two moxes, right? I didn't miscount or anything, right? 
Oh, Wear Tear doesn't actually destroy an artifact in white. It destroys an artifact in red. So if you're like mono white and you draft Wear Tear, you ain't going to have be, a bad time. You ain't going to be killing any artifacts. I used the my dad joke outside this stream. Yeah, it doesn't, it's not, it really doesn't make any sense if you use it outside the stream, <laughs> really. <laughs> hey, Mike, who are you hanging out with? My dad. Yeah, and then if you said that, no one's gonna, no one's gonna be like, like, uh, cool, I guess. All right, well, that's why you're hanging out with your dad. I don't know why you said it all weird. <laughs> yeah, that's my all right. dad. All right, man, have fun, I guess. And you enjoy yourself. Wow, man, I, I'm, I'm still dead from that. <laughs> it's pretty good. God, Nick is something else, man. Yep, that's a cool one. All right, what are we getting here? Can we, oh, we can we can uh, Oblivion Ring their Mox Diamond. What's that worth? I don't know, man. I don't know what's worth anything anymore. I feel like that's not worth. This it. is the best chat on Twitch. We have it all, and now you have some more bits. What a time to be alive, bits. Zaxor, thank you so much, buddy. Really appreciate it. You are awesome. I just want to be a. Zaxor. You remember that song? No. Yeah, it wasn't a real song. I was trying to trick you. I can see you're too smart for me. I kind of want to take them off this. Yeah, I'm going to do it. Get them. Get them. Get them. Disenchant is in the cube. We've passed it multiple times. I think MTG Bot is not up to date on the current cube. It was li we literally saw it. We literally saw it. Bot is a liar. Cause bot's a liar. That's from Henry Rollins. It's a song called "Bot is a Liar." It's an old school song. Yeah, I'll just take three. I'm not scared of you. For all your golems, land. Of course not. <laughs> you know that seems to be a theme we're having for this draft. It's I like don't understand. We never it. draw lands. It's really bad, and it happens every game. It's literally been every game, and it's very strange. Yes, it makes me wonder if the algorithm is off, like or the the whatever whatever randomness they use for lands. Like this is the biggest thing that makes me think it because it's like if I had seventeen lands, I would draw enough lands ordinarily. But because two of my lands are actually moxes. Whatever random shuffler it uses it might be seeing 15 actual lands. So it might be distributing only the lands in a specific way that is not uh, similar to the way it distributes the other cards, the other non-land cards. Does that make sense? Yes. Uh, this is kind of weird. Oh, uh, white. Sure. Seems. Thank Thanks you. for the freebie. <sighs> Two very good four drops in our hand. Cannot cast them. The only reason I feel like we're losing these games, I mean, not to say that we'd be winning uh, the matches or the games, but, I mean, the only reason we're, we're definitively losing is because we just can't, can't draw lands. Yeah, yeah, it's really frustrating. Might as well equip. So I'm pretty sure they're just going to sack Mana Vault, Golem, and called out the Forge Master. And end up killing us with something. Does MTG use the true? I don't. I don't know what they use because I don't think they've ever released uh, their programming. I don't think you have ever had access to like what they specifically use. But you see what I'm saying? Like, if you have, uh, if the if the shuffler for so in some way takes lands and they take spells. And they give you a distribution of those. The distribution is going to be different, whether it's 15 and and 25, and if it's 17 and 23, right? So if it only sees 15 and 23 or 15 and 25 because two moxes are over here, the distribution is going to be different than if it's 17 and 23. Does that make sense? I mean, I'm just. I'm just spitballing. I'm not gonna like. I have no idea. I don't know. Yeah, no proof. Right. I'm not. I'm not gonna make. I'm not making any crazy claims or anything like that. 
But when we get yeah. to a point where I'm like, I've drawn 12 cards, and I've drawn more four drops than lands, you know, it's... Some, Not good. Something's a little strange. If lands are weighted differently than spells, exactly, because now I have 15 cards that are weighted differently rather than 17 cards that are weighted differently because of the moxes. <clears throat> You have drawn four lands outside of the opening hands in seven games. Yeah, this is not a reasonable amount of of lands. Unfortunately. Unfortunately, this is not caregiver, core caregiver, or whatever that card's called. That also wouldn't work because there's only other creatures. Another creature you can... Tr oh, that's right. So no, in no way would that have worked. Giver of runes. All right, so I guess we'll just go to 11 here. And How are they not... Sure. You know what? Sure. I'll take it. If it was a land, though, we could give this flying with Elspeth, attack for five, untap the four lands, and play another four drop. But, no bueno. So instead, I'm just going to play this. No bueno. Oh, it's a one-two, actually. Yeah, so it would be a three-four. So I guess we could block. I guess that would have been better. I actually didn't even realize it was a 1-2. That's actually great. Wow, Giver of Runes is nuts. I mean, it can be Fatal Push, but, you know, a lot of times Mother of Runes would be Fatal Push too in a format that has Mother of Runes on Fatal Push. I mean, don't get me wrong. I would see six lands in a row as random as well. That's completely random because it's going to happen from time to time. My problem is the consistency in the last four or five games where we haven't drawn more than three or four lands in the, in the entire game. That's what I'm talking about. Land. Okay, now we're coming through. Now we're coming through. It's lit. <laughs> Let's play Elspeth. Well, I have no blue mana. <clears throat> I'm waiting for them to sack things and play Sphinx of the Steel Wind, so we just we just lose. Uh, I wish this wasn't equipped here, because now we can't actually untap our lands. Why not? Because we can't equip this. Oh, we can give this flying, though, can't yeah. we? Yeah. Yeah, I guess so. That's pretty good. I was like, what you talking about? Well, I don't want to have Mother of Ruins, like, tapped is the problem. They have no interaction with it. I don't think they... <laughs> so I they, guess... There's, like, plenty I of guess. <clears throat> I guess. Oh, we also get to untap and play Avacyn if we want to, so that's pretty okay. That should be. All right, third eight. Maybe we just win this game. I don't know what's going on, man. Oh, this card in Mystic Snaku. <clears throat> oh, that guy's a snack. <clears throat> I mean, snake. <clears throat> Get out of here, scrumbly throat. All right, Scrumbly. we're just gonna gonna pass here because we have two instant speed boys. Yeah, you heard me, Scrumbly. What do they got? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven mana for artifacts. Alternatively, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight mana. Yikes! I, I imagine they do it for four, and then we flash in Avacyn. This is actually fine. Yep, that's what we figured they'd do. So, all right. Oh, Billy Biscuits. Shut up and take my money. <clears throat> One scrumbly throat bone. <laughs> Something is all scratchy. I don't know why. I'm like, what are you doing, man? Just stop it. Oh, 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 Mary. We actually could have won, actually. We should have played this in response to this because it would have survived and then she would have flipped. So, that's our bad. I don't like winning anyway, I guess. No, they wouldn't have flipped because they don't, they don't die. I'm dumb. Yeah, you guys are right. 
Sugar's on death. Yeah, everybody. Everybody in the chat, make sure I know. <laughs> yuck, yuck, yuck. Can you guys make sure it's a merry little Christmas? Do I just attack their face here? Yeah, Ugin doesn't do anything right right now. It can lightning bolt. That's pretty much it. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I'm just gonna go to your face. I just want my lands back. And then I'll play Sun Titan. Sun Tootles, if you will. <coughs> can you shut up? Let's try. Okay. Are we winning this game? I don't even know what's going on, man. I'm f I feel like this game is not... Yeah, they haven't used their Forge Master, which is really Oh, weird. they just died of their own Mana Vault! Oh, I guess they can untap it. Dang it! But they can untap it with this, so they literally have to go 1, 2, 3, 4, which turns Mana Confluence off, which leaves them with Workshop and Mana Confluence. And they can't top the Confluence. Yeah, so they only have 6 Mana for Artifacts this turn. Oh, you got so lucky. Oh my god, what do you... Oh, what? Was that an accident? I don't no, know I'm if that... I'm pretty sure that was on purpose. Alright, well, who knows. I can't believe we won that game, though. I guess if you if you draw a bunch of lands before... Uh, I after think our opponent seven. just sucks. Oh, we just win the match. Okay, well... Told you. Good games. <laughs> Alright. Why does it say 1-1? One, one? I don't know. That's not how that works. What? Are we going to fix anything? Is anything broken? Do we just... 15 lands and 2 moxes. That is 17 sources of 0 mana. That's... You know what? I'm curious to see what would happen if you took if out the moxes I was and played same. 2 lands. And then we just start hitting all our land drops. <clears throat> Let's try it again. Yeah, they conceded during sideboarding. They are like, I can't deal with this... With this deck. I guess. But I guess. Look, just have yourself a Merry Christmas, okay? Buddy, I have myself a Merry Christmas every day. Dang... What day is it? Wednesday? I have a Merry Christmas. Is it Friday? Merry Christmas then, too. What is it? Sunday? I'm having a Merry you know Christmas. You know it's a Merry Christmas, baby. You know it's a Merry Christmas. <laughs> I'm going to keep this because I've never seen a hand like this before. I don't know why you would mulligan that hand either way. Right, but I, I'm just... Actually, this this early is pretty good. Yeah, early with hit with that is big damage. It's big damage. Looks like Mike's in the pocket of like big to, damage. I, I don't like to support big damage, okay? <laughs> <laughs> I guess you just want another one of those big damage lobbyists. Have yourself a merry little big damage. What's the command for the chicken Sunday clip? Uh, is it not Sunday? Is it not chicken Sunday? There it is. It's gotta be. It's just chicken Sunday, right? Every day. Is chicken Sunday. That's Mike's British government plan. It's very Oh, we're just gonna brim ass here. Brim ass with protection. That's pretty good. They discarded Jace Bellerin. Wow, they're crazy. <clears throat> You're correct. I'm in danger. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I need that for this I need that for the soundboard for sure. Did you see there's a stream there's a stream deck XL? That has 32 buttons on the face. You probably Whoa. didn't see. Oh no, I didn't. Because it's it's actually not even released yet. But it's if you guys want to give me a birthday present, my birthday's in June. If you guys want to give me a birthday present, Stream Deck XL, guys. There you go. It's gonna be. It's look at that. Look how many buttons that is, man. I believe that this uh, one has 15. 32. The new one has 30, 32 on the front. So every page has 17. X, it's so many buttons. I can't even handle it. How much is it? Uh, it's two fifty. The regular one's a hundred, but you're definitely getting. It also has a nicer stand. The stand is magnetic. I don't like this stand because it really it flops off a lot. Your mom flops off a lot. Yeah. Oh. No, it's true. He's right. She's a real flopper. I'm gonna play this one, even though this one's probably big damage. Yeah, I think it's this one. We're playing around days here. I hope they don't uh, do anything that I care about. 
you know, in general, just yeah, I'm not nothing, nothing specific. I just anything that I care about. I hope they don't do that. <clears throat> and I do, I really do hope they have themselves a merry little Christmas. What do you copy here? My big brims? Probably. I guess. They can copy their own crucible. That's pretty good. So I can just give pro white and smash in, right? Mm-hmm. Hmm. We can also flicker wisp this. I kind of like that. And then I don't have to turn my mom on. Oh, next turn we get to, uh... Next turn we get to, uh... Equip the other sword. <laughs> yeah, I'll shoot you, I guess. Oh, look at all the lands now. Now the lands are plentiful. Do you, do you, do you, do you clone the Flicker Wisp? Because that seems, that seems worse. You do? Huh. What, do you blink Brimast? Or a token, maybe? Oh, they blink our mom? No, they blink a token? I don't know. That seems worse than Brimaz. <sighs> oh, 100 plentiful land bids. Phil Rickner, thank you so much, buddy. Really appreciate it. You are also still the, the bit leader here. By a sizable bit margin. He was the leader of the bits. Whoa. Okay, so let it be known that Goblin Nick is just a meme lord. This is another. This is this is a meme that Goblin Nick just made, and this is also. Uh, <laughs> it's pretty good. Oh Jesus! Oh God, it's just so good. Yep, that's. Uh, oh, we just won the game. I don't know what's happening now. Remember we were doing really poorly, and then we ended up winning the game the last round, and I don't even understand how. And then we're winning this round, and I don't understand how. I've heard the Planeswalker Momir is pretty bad. How do I think Modern Horizons is going to change Magic as a whole? I don't think it's going to change Magic as a whole, but I think it's a good set. And I think it. Uh, I think the the idea of the set, uh, what it means, that you can like make a set that just adds a lot of that adds a lot of modern cards that doesn't have to go through standard anymore. I think that's really important. This is another matchup where I wish we had an artifact thing to, to kill artifacts, but here we are. I also wish I had these, but I think I think the deck is actually fine. All right, I'm just gonna submit like this, I guess. I forgot what's a scrober. Do you know what a scrober is? <clears throat> it's a bober dad. A scrober is a bober dad. Oh, this is nice. Should I answer this random call? No. I shouldn't do it on stream and have everybody. This never works, dude. It works. Let's see what this is. Man. It's probably your robot dad. It's my robot dad. Boot do 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 do. That turn one search for Ascanto, that's pretty solid. I was hoping for a Mox myself, because I have two. And then I could play a two drop on turn one. But, you know, magic's hard. You doing okay? Yeah. We'll stretch after this. We'll do our little exercises. <laughs> Michael has to do his little exercises. When was the last time I went to physical therapy? A week. You still going or? They want to wait for me to get an MRI. So I gotta get Are you MRI. getting one? I'm trying to, yeah. You need to call that doctor? Let's call him right now on stream. Uh, What time is it? Call his house. <laughs> don't have his house number. <laughs> call his office and get his house number. That doesn't, they don't do that. Call, do call Dr. House. <laughs> Boy, they sure do have a lot of mana. 
all your mana, and you have nothing to threaten me with. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven mana if they want to play an artifact, four if they don't. Well, looks like they do. Okay. Well, probably gonna just oblivion ring that because it's very it's very scary. I hope you don't have any lands in hand. God, they always have lands. Oh, I like a Gideon Blackblade. All right, we're just playing that instead. Gideon Black, do 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 do. Play hey hey do 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 do. Crew this thing do 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 do. Gideon Blackblade, and then we're gonna target this guy, and we're gonna give it Life Link. You remember Life Link? That's that thing you click. When you fall and you can't get up. Help, I've fallen and I can't get up. I mean, it's life alert. I know someone in the chat's going to be like, Actually, Frank, that's life alert. <laughs> and I'm going to be like, Shut up, please. Ooh, play homage. Say say carnage. Dang it, they never say homage. They never say carnage. carnage, rather. Dang it. Did you really want carnage? Yeah, because I think getting rid of... This, 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 and this is much better than the, my two. Then they're left with, like, what, Island Misha's Workshop? Yeah, get rid of that junk. Baby shark. Doo -doo -doo -doo. It only kills one land. Still pretty annoying. I mean, we can just O-ring it. And then they get rid of their last island. This is actually fine. You have drawn your last island. Michael B. Michael B. Unfortunately, we can't attack with both of these guys, though. <clears throat> That's true. Uh, it's one other creature you control. This isn't a creature unless we activate this. So I think we're actually just attacking with the Gideon. We're going to plus Gideon and then activate the Gideon. Because we don't actually need anything in our hand. We have plenty of things to play. Are we on? I bet I bet now they're on the Carnage train. Oh, yeah, now you're voting Carnage, huh? Sorry, buddy. You get the cards now. You had your chance. That seems bad without a creature. That does. Are they playing the same stipulation we are? <laughs> are we both doing sword stip? Um, is there anything we can blink that's relevant? Or do we just play a Danto Vanguard? I'd play Van Boy. A Van Boy. And we can activate. Well, we can activate with Flicker Wisp too. Yeah, but there's nothing to blink blink. There's nothing to blink blink. When does it come back? The end of the turn? Uh-huh. Yeah, that's fine. <whistles> what are you giving it here? Indestructible? Probably lifelink still. Yeah, vigilance and none of those none of those are relevant. Now we can exile permanence. I will draw a card. Um, don't think we care about that. I don't think we do either. I think the instant speed and the flyers are just better here. They're at six. And we have a nuclear <laughs> weapon on board. <laughs> we do have a nuclear weapon on board. Gideon's going to go nuclear soon. Uh, does Flicker Wisp unflip search? Maybe, but then they just flip it the next turn anyway, so it's not really like... It's not that great. Can you just can you not just do that thing where you exile their stuff forever because of flicker and rest? I mean, it would be like one turn. You yeah. just need a lot more mana for that. We'll homage again. Shut up and take my money. One playing swords with opponent buck. <laughs> Gideon has a sword. We're gonna win with that. This guy has a sword too. There's swords everywhere. Let's see if they put a card in there and flip it. They do. Kalot fourth match. Put it. This is this the same deck we just played against? No winter orb though. No Wintley Bentley. 
Yeah, a, a spear is just a long sword. Actually, a long sword is a long sword, I guess. <laughs> Did you say Windley Bentley? Yeah. Huh. I hope you're proud of yourself. Trinket Maggio. Baby Mike. Michael B. Do, 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 do. That's his name. Do, 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 do. This is game two. Do, 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 do. One game one. Destroy Exile and Online Permanent. Sure. And they can't equip this guy because Workshop doesn't let you do that. I wish Workshop let you activate mana artifact abilities, but then, like. And then I think, like, this card doesn't need to be better. Good games? Well, the Sundering Titan leaving kind of hurt my land situation. Yeah, Sundering Titan's a dangerous dude. I don't know if we're... I don't know if you're dead yet. I guess if we play Flicker Wisp, Exile the Trinket Mage. And then we attack with everybody, you're probably dead because you have to deal with two of these guys. And that seems unlikely. Oh, we win the game. All right, 2-1 with the sword tip. Five swords in our deck and a batter skull, and we still win the game. That's pretty sweet. 2-1's not bad. Thank you guys for watching. Slam those like and subscribe buttons. Check me out at meundies.com slash franklaporia. You get 15% off along with free shipping and free returns. You can check me out at manatraders.com as well. You can use the link and the promo code in the description to get 20% off your first three months of any subscription. And I'll see you guys next time. Thank you so much for watching. Really appreciate it. Slam those like and subscribe buttons. Slam those follow and, and subscribe buttons on Twitch. And I'll see you next time.